Hi everyone, this is Chef Andy from Keto Fine Dining and welcome back to my channel. So I was thinking, I don't know anyone who doesn't like mayo. It's silky smooth, creamy, savory and it just makes everything taste so much better. Not to mention it's the base for so many salad dressings, sauces and so many other recipes. Unfortunately, most of the mayonnaise that sells in stores I made out of different blends of the cheapest and unhealthiest oils on the market. They are made of different blends like canola, palm, soy and many other vegetables. And I hate to break it to you, but even when you see some of the mayo in stores that says made with avocado oil, it's not actually made entirely out of avocado oil. Many brands like Hellman's, they use only about 5-10% to of actual avocado in their mayo. Just enough so they can write on their label, made with avocado oil, tricking customers thinking that it's actually a much healthier option over other choices so they can get their sales up. So not all oils are created equal. A lot of them can do a lot of harm to your body. As a general rule of thumb is, the healthiest oils are the ones that are either made of fruits or nuts. Like for example avocados, coconuts, olives and almonds. And the worst oils for your health are the ones that are made of vegetables. Like for example canola, palm, sunflower and soy. So with this knowledge in mind, let me show you a super easy way how you can make your own mayo in just 5 minutes by using one of the healthiest oils on the market and turn something that has such a bad rap into a superfood. So let's get started. The first step is to combine all the oils into a measuring cup. So that would be 250 grams of avocado oil, 100 grams of olive oil, 25 grams of flaxseed oil, 75 grams of MCT oil. MCT is short for medium chain triglyceride that is extracted from coconut oil. It supports energy, weight loss, immune system, cognitive function and much more. The next step is to take a smaller container and combine two tablespoons of water one tablespoon of lemon juice which is exactly half a lemon Then half a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar. And a quarter teaspoon of salt. Give it a quick mix and set it aside. The next step is to start emulsification. For this you're gonna need a small plastic bowl and a hand mixer. Add to a bowl two egg yolks then one teaspoon of Dijon mustard and start whisking it just long enough to incorporate mustard with the egg yolks. Next step is to take a measuring cup with the oil and start adding oil very slowly, just few drops at a time, while whisking it constantly until the mixture begins to thicken. When you're about halfway through the oil, pause for a second and slowly add about half of the liquid mixture to make sure that the emulsification is not going to fail. Then you can go back to slowly add in the rest of the oil and after that add the rest of the mixture. That's it, the mayo is ready. It's pretty easy once you know the process. It just needs a little bit of patience when adding the oil.
Okay, let's give it a try. Mm. It tastes absolutely perfect. I love this recipe so much because every single ingredient I use in this recipe is a superfood. It's hard to believe that something this healthy can be so incredibly delicious. Wow. Mm. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you want me to keep releasing new recipes, then you can support this channel by subscribing, hitting a like button and leaving in the comments below on how I can improve this channel or just any thoughts that you might have and I would really appreciate the input. Thanks for watching and I'll see you very soon in the next episode. Bye!